I cannot believe how far along my CV is coming. And guys, just a couple of weeks ago, my neighbor, Ed, he has a 32 foot CV and we put in two tilt out tackle units into his center console. And man, are those things nice. I want them in my boat. And I called Pat Brown, the owner of BoatOutfitters.com. They not only made those tackle units, but they also provide them to the boating public. And I had them sent down to CV and I want them installed. And back then I didn't know about what we're about to unveil to you guys because there's been a lot of research, a lot of R&D has been done on what we're about to show you. But who we now have on the program is John Thompson. And John is with Sudbury, a very, very old company in the marine industry. You've been around forever. And you're very well known for this product right here. This is called Boat Soap. Yep. All right. It's a great boat soap for your vessel. You make the bilge cleaners. You make the stuff that takes off the barnacles or the brown mustaching. But apparently, there's always been a problem with having some type of marine adhesive or some type of marine caulk sticking to King Starboard and my tilt outs yes. are King Starboard. Yep. Okay. You've revolutionized the, the caulk world and I want to get into that. H how is the Sudbury caulk, how, how is it different from what's out in the general public? Well, the Sudbury elastomeric sealant is different. It's not a polysulfide, it's not a polyurethane, it's a synthetic rubber. Uh, and, the, and with the synthetic rubber, it will stick to fiberglass, glass, starboard, aluminum, uh, just about anything you have on a boat, it will stick to. So and, and tenaciously. How, how does it do that? How, do, uh, how does it it's bond to starboard? It's a formula that has some solvents in it, but we also liquefy. When we're in the manufacturing process, we're actually liquefying rubber, and it becomes a, it's, it's basically a rubber sealant. Okay. Uh, and what it does is uh, it adheres. Uh, once the solvent flashes off, it adheres, and it, all you're left is... Uh, is with an elastomeric sealant that has 50% elongation. Okay. Uh, so, and it's so it's flexible. actually kind of etching. It's kind of kind of chemically yes. burning into the surface of King Starboard. Yes. And that's what's holding it. Yes. Now, now this guys are two little pieces of King Starboard. This is your sealant right here. And if you were to do marine uh, silicone or or 5200, and if you were to try to pull that thing, it snap right off. It pop right off. This isn't coming it's, off. It is a three to five day cure time, so right. you need to have me mechanically fasten it. Is it just for King Starboard, or nope, can I it can use be this used, on other fittings? It can be used on any part of your boat for uh, through hauls, above waterline, below waterline. You're talking above and well, above and below waterline, not yeah. not like a silicone. Silicones, guys, you cannot use below the waterline. Okay, they're great above the waterline, but Which, you can't use them below. So, some some of the stuff that you, you can use it on any electronic mounts, any uh, lights, uh, any cleats. Uh, any chocks. No, 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 John, you're making it in different colors. There's a lot of different colors of starboard. How in the world are you doing that? Well, we, we actually use, w w with the sealant, we've been able to colorize it w with different pigments, and we have, we now we have a, a, a brown, which is mahogany or teak. We have a clear, uh, we have a white, we have a sea foam, which is a, uh, I don't know if that's a trademark, but it's a, it's, it's, it's starboard color. We have a black and we have a gray. And, uh, if, and, and these, if a manufacturer out there was a boat builder or they're making parts or something like that and they had a proprietary color, could you match it to them? Absolutely. Years past for Triumph Boats we did. We made, a, we made an off-white for them and it matched their, uh, their rotomold uh, plastic boats that they had made. Okay, so John, almost every boater out there has starboard on their boat and they need to seal stuff off. Okay, they're going to need this caulk. It works on everything. It can come in any color. It can really make your boat look amazing. Absolutely. How, how do people and where do people get it? They can get it at a local chandlery. They can get it at BoatOutfitters.com. They can get it at SudburyBoatCare.com. Pat Brown from BoatOutfitters.com. Remember, guys, this is the largest consumer of King Starboard in the world. Okay, is now actually using this in their manufacturing and they're selling it on their website. They tested it. This stuff really comes highly recommended. And John, it's all because of you, man. Thank you.